Hello everyone, in this video I'm going to do some applications about calculating the pH. Let's get started. State whether each of the following statements is true or false. First one we have here. The pH of 0 0.1 mole per cubic decimeter HCl is 2. Well, this is the concentration of the acid. This is strong acid. So the concentration of HCl is equal to the concentration of hydrogen. So this is considered to be the concentration of hydrogen. But it is 10 to the power negative 1. 0 0.1 is 10 to the power negative 1. So the pH should be 1, not 2. So the first one here is false. So we have to know this formula. The concentration of hydrogen ion is equal to 10 to the power negative pH. What we have here is 10 to the power negative 1. So the pH should be 1. So the first one is false. Or you can just put it in the calculator and you will know that it is false. But in case it's a multiple choice question in paper 1, so you do have to know that 0 0.1 is 10 to the power negative 1. And you do have to know that 10 to the power negative pH is equal to the concentration of hydrogen. Let's check the next one. The concentration of hydrogen ions in a solution of pH is equal to 3 is 100 times the concentration of hydrogen ions in a solution of pH 5. Well, the, there, are, there are two uh, values difference. So pH 3, pH 5. And we already know that 1 value pH is equivalent to 10 times more or less concentration of hydrogen. What does it mean by more or less? If I am moving from 3 to 4, so I have less 10 times less concentration of hydrogens. Then 5, so 100 times uh, uh, less concentration of hydrogens. So I'm moving here from 3 to 5, so the concentration of hydrogen in solution of pH 5 is 10, 10 times 10 times the hydrogen, yes, so this statement is correct. The concentration of hydrogens in, in pH 3 are, are, of course, 100 times the concentration of hydrogens in pH 5. As we go up with the pH value, the concentration of hydrogen should decrease. Okay, so one value of pH is equivalent to 100 times more or less concentration of hydrogens. Uh, C. The concentration of hydrogen in a solution of a pH 13 is, is, is 1 by 10 to the power negative. Uh, uh, oh, 10 to the power 13. Okay. False. Why false? We have already know the formula. Uh, concentration of hydrogen is equal to 10 to the power negative pH. Okay. What we have here is 10 to the power so we should what we should have here if we have uh, 13 so it should be 10 to the power negative 13 not 13 so negative 13 so the only mistake here is that it should be written as 10 to the power negative 13. next the ph of 0 0.01 mole per cubic decimeter h2so4 is 2. h2so4 is strong acid so the concentration of the acid is equal, is equal to the concentration of hydrogen. But we do know that it is diprotic, so it is equivalent to is or equal to double the concentration of hydrogen. So what we should do is we have to write the equation to know the more ratio. As you can see here, it's 1 to 2. So the concentration of H2SO4 is equal to 2 multiplied or doubled the concentration of hydrogen. So it's 2 by the concentration that we have here. And pH, if you put it in the calculator, pH is equal to a negative log. So a negative log 2 by uh, 0 0.01 is 1.7. Okay. So I have to always remember that I should use this formula. Uh, let's check another uh, question. Arrange the following in order of increasing the pH. We have the following solutions that we'd like to check. Okay, so HCl. We have here the concentration of HCl. First of all, HCl is strong, so it's equal. It's the concentration of HCl is equal to the concentration of hydrogen. The concentration of hydrogen is 0 0.01 
or we can write it as 10 to the power negative 2. So the pH here is 2. Okay, let's check the next one. NaOH, it's equivalent to OH negative. Okay, what we have here is 1. What we have here is 1. It's like, it is, 1 is like 10 to the power negative uh, or 10 to the power 0. So the POH is 0. So pH here is 14. Next one, we have H2SO4. H2SO4, the concentration of H2SO4, diprotic. So it's equivalent to 2 concentration of hydrogen. So 0 0.1. So if we have 0 0.1, so it will be here 0 0.2, equivalent to 2 concentration of hydrogen. Uh, so we should have, of course, negative log 0 0.2. It will be a, a, a big number, more than 2. Here we have here um, 0 0.1 cubic uh, mole, 0 0.1 mole per cubic decimeter HCl. Concentration of HCl is equivalent to the concentration of hydrogens. So uh, if we have 0 0.1, so we should have 0 0.1. Uh, 0 0.1 is 10 to the power negative 1. So pH is 1. Okay, so which one has the lowest pH? Of course, H2SO4 will be the first one. So the first one will be H2SO4 because if you checked the uh, pH of 0 0.2, it will be lower than 2. I said more than 2. No, it will be lower than 2. So the pH will be lower than 2. So this is number 1. And we have here number 2, pH 1. Then we have here number 3. Then we have here 4. That's it.